Hi, it's Miss Dolores from Baldwin Borough Public Library. Welcome to Tiny Tales. We are unbelievably on week five already of our eight week Tiny Tales program. And thank you for tuning in. Today we're going to do a theme of the farm. So there are a few things that you can have uh, for story time that will help you join in. So I'm gonna show you them. Um, the first one is two sticks or anything that taps together. So you could have two wooden spoons or anything that would make a sound. Um, something that shakes. You could do um, spices that you have in your cabinet or a toy, like a rattle or anything that you have that shakes. Um, I have a musical scarf, but you could have a, um, a washcloth, a dish towel, anything that you can wave. And if you have them at the end, um, we blow our bubbles. So if you have any bubbles at home, you can have those too. Okay. So we're gonna get started. Um, we're gonna do Hey Little Friend. And if you take your two fingers and you hug them, this is friend, this is friend. All right, so we're gonna do it like this. Hey little friend now, hey little friend now, you're a little friend of mine, of mine. Hey little friend now, hey little friend now, you're a little friend of mine. Okay, then you get something that shakes, ready? We'll go shaking through the town. We'll go shaking all around. We'll go shaking here and there. We'll go shaking everywhere. And stop. Good job. Hey, little friend now. Hey, little friend now. You're a little friend of mine. Okay, you ready for verse two? Here we go. Hey, little friend now. Hey, little friend now. You're a little friend of mine, of mine. Hey, little friend now. Hey, little friend now. You're a little friend of mine. All right, we're going to tap. Are you ready? Do you have your wooden sticks or something that taps? Ready? We'll go tapping through the town. We'll go tapping all around. We'll go tapping here and there. We'll go tapping everywhere. Can you go really fast? Good job, and stop. Good job. Ready? Hey, little friend now. Hey, little friend now. You're a little friend of mine. All right, this is the last verse. We're going to have something that waves. Can you get something? I'm going to have my scarf. Are you ready? Here we go. Hey, little friend now. Hey, little friend now. You're a little friend of mine, of mine. Hey, little friend now. Hey, little friend now. You're a little friend of mine. All right, you ready to wave? Here we go. We'll go waving through the town. We'll go waving all around. We'll go waving here and there. We'll go waving everywhere. Can you wave really fast? Good job, and stop. Hey, little friend now. Hey, little friend now. You're a little friend of mine. All right, the last one. I'm going to do it with my bear, but you can sit with somebody. Um, with a with an adult friend and we're gonna jump. Are you ready? Or if you're big enough, you could just jump on your own. All right, you ready? Hey, little friend now. Hey, little friend now. You're a little friend of mine, of mine. Hey, little friend now. Hey, little friend now. You're a little friend of mine. Ready to jump? We'll go jumping through the town. We'll go jumping all around. We'll go jumping here and there. We'll go jumping everywhere. Can you jump really fast? Good job. All right, last time. Hey, little friend now. Hey, little friend now. You're a little friend of mine. Give yourselves a big super clap. That was awesome. All right, so on the farm, we're going to do um, two books today. The first one, well, they're both guessing. They're both um, books that you can guess the animal. So this one is a new series of books that's available in the library. This is one of them. This one's called Moo Moo Choo Choo Sounds from the Farm. And these have pages in that when you turn them, they're not board books, but they're pages that will not rip. So that's always a plus. You don't have to worry about ripping the pages. So I'm gonna come closer so that you can see the pictures and you can guess the animals. Moo Moo Choo Choo written by Jennifer Schrand.
Did you hear that? Do you hear a sound? I don't hear a sound yet. Are you ready? I hear moo, 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 and 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 swat, swat, swat. What is that? All right. What is that that goes moo and chews a lot of grass and swishes the tail and swats away flies? Do you know that? Did you guess a cow? If you did, you are right. It's a cow mooing and chewing as his tail swishes and swats. Okay, they have to swat all those bugs away. That's how they do it, because they don't have hands, so they swat it away with their tail. You ready for a new animal? I hear oink, 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 and and walla, 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 and what is that? Okay, what animal says oink oink and goes <coughs> and likes to wallow in mud? Do you have a guess? Did you guess a pig? Look at that pig rolling in the mud. It's the pigs squealing and snorting in the mud. Good guess. All right, you ready for another one? I hear honk, honk, honk. They're moving with a waddle, 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 and a ruffle, 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 and a flap, flap, flap. What is that? All right, what animal goes honk, 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 and lives near water? Can you guess? Good job. It's a gaggle of geese honking and waddling as they wander around. Let's count the geese. One, two, three, four, five. Good job counting. All right, you ready for a new animal guess? I hear nay, 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 and me, we, clippity clop, clippity clop, clippity clop. What animal is that? What animal goes nay and trots along like this? Did you guess? If you guess the horse, you are right. It's a trotting horse going clippity clop, clop, clop. It looks happy, running a, running around. Let's get another animal, ready? I hear bah, 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 and peck, 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 scratch, 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 and cock a doodle doo. What is that? Can you guess the animal that clucks and says cock a doodle doo? Do you know? It is a, it's the chickens and the rooster pecking and clucking all about. Okay, so here are the chickens. Here's little baby chicks over here. Here's the chickens, one, two, three, four, five, and one rooster. Did you guess those? Let's guess another one. I hear ee-oh, ee-oh. It's moving slow with a shuffle, 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 and a scuffle, 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 and a dawdle, dawdle, dawdle. What is that? What animal says? Hee-haw, hee-haw. Did you guess? All right, let's see if you're right. It's a dawdling donkey shuffling and scuffling. All right, I know someone that owns a donkey. Maybe someday we can meet the donkey. All right, I hear and gulp, gulp, gulp with all sorts of splish, 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 and splash, splash, splash. What is that? Okay, slurping and gulping and splishing and splashing. Can you guess that animal? It's all the farm animals slurping and gulping at the water trough. Okay, so it's all the animals that we had in our book the pig, the donkey, the horse, the cow, the geese, they are all taking a drink and that's called a water trough. And see the water comes down and it fills this up and then they can line up along it and many animals can drink instead of one at a time. Wait, did you hear that? Okay, so that's a chance for you to make up your own animal. So maybe the grown-up you're with can make an animal sound and you can guess it. Go ahead.
A grown up can make an animal sound and you can guess. So these are cool books. This one's Moo Moo Choo Choo. So we have four or five in this series now and the pages are really super nice. Um, they're just like a um, picture book page, but they don't rip. So I hope you enjoyed Moo Moo Choo Choo today. And we're going to do a little um, song about the farm and this is called Grandpa's Farm. So you can take whatever you use to shake and we're gonna, um, we're gonna shake along and I'm gonna grab my bag and we're gonna guess animal sounds. Are you ready? We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a big brown, what do you think it is? A big brown what? A big brown dog. Did you guess a dog? Yes, dogs live on the farm too. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a big brown dog. The dog, he makes a sound like this. What sound does the dog make? Woof, woof. The dog, he makes a sound like this. Woof, woof. Good job. All right, let's get our shaker. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. All right, are you ready? Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a little woolly. What is woolly? Did you guess it? Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a little woolly sheep. The sheep, he makes a sound like this. What's the sheep say? <laughs> the sheep, he makes a sound like this. <laughs> Are you ready for your shaker? We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. All right. Are you ready to guess? Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a really loud rooster. A rooster. You ready? Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a really loud rooster. The rooster, he makes a sound like this. What's a rooster say? He was in our book. The rooster, he makes a sound like this. Cock a doodle doo. All right, you ready? We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Okay, last one. You might not expect this one. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a black and white. Do you know what's black and white? Skunk. Oh, down on Grandpa's farm, there is a black and white skunk. The skunk, he makes a sound like this. The skunk, he makes a sound like this. All right, when skunks don't like something, they spray from their back end. They spray, and then it stinks. So there's our black and white skunk, and we find those many places. All right, get your shaker. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Give yourselves a big super, super, super clap. All right, we're going to get our sticks, and we're going to sing our alphabet song today. So if you can get either your two wooden spoons or two things that tap together, we're going to sing our alphabet song two times today. Are you ready? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my A, B, C's. Next time won't you sing with me? All right, now we're going to take, if you have two, um, Wooden spoons, we're gonna scrape the handles together and have them make a sound. Are you ready? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now I know my A, B, C's. Next time won't you sing with me good job you were awesome with your alphabet song all right
So then we're going to get something that you have that's either a towel or a washcloth. And if you hold it up, you will see that where they meet, it's called the corner. We're going to count how many. So we're going to count the corners. Ready? One, two, three, four. And this makes the shape of a square. And we're going to be silly and we're going to put the square on our heads. Can you put your towel or your scarf or your washcloth on your head? And we're going to pretend like it's a hat. Do you remember how many corners there were? We counted four. It goes like this. My hat has four corners. Four corners has my hat. And if there weren't four corners, it would not be a hat. But it might be a blanket. Can you put that scarf or washcloth or towel on your legs like a nice warm blanket? Are you ready? My blanket has four corners. Four corners has my blanket. And if there weren't four corners, it would not be a blanket. But it might be a, you ready? Superhero cape. Can you put your towel or washcloth or dish towel around your neck like a superhero? Ready? My cape has four corners. Four corners has my cape. And if there weren't four corners, it would not be a cape. All right, we're gonna take it off and we're gonna do a little trick. So we're gonna get our um, washcloth or towel. We're gonna fold it in half. Now we have a rectangle. And then we're gonna get the other corners and we're gonna put them together. And now we have a small square and we're gonna use that as a pillow. Are you ready? My pillow has four corners. Four corners has my pillow. And if there weren't four corners, it would not be my pillow. But it might be my hat. Give yourselves a big super clap. So sometimes we can get really silly with things that we have around the house. We can put them on our heads. We can wave them. We can sing with them. So lots of things that we can do with something that has four corners. All right, we're gonna do our second story today. This is also a guessing story. This is called Farm Animals and it's by Sims Tabak. All right, so in this story, when I open the pages, it's gonna show you part of an animal. It might show you a foot or a mouth and you try to guess what animal it is by the time I open it all the way up. All right, are you ready? Farm animals. Who am I? I have a snout. Okay, this is the nose of the animal. It's called a snout. Do you know what animal that is? Can you make a guess? I'll give you another clue. Okay, I have a snout. I have a curly tail. I am a pig. Did you guess a pig? So this book is great. It gives you really nice big pictures. I am a pig. All right, and then you fold it back up and you can go on to the next animal. Ready to guess? Who am I? I have a feathery tail. All right, this is the tail of the animal. Can you guess before we go on? All right, let me give you another clue. I have a feathery tail. I crow when the sun comes up. Oh, when the sun comes up. What animal crows when the sun comes up? I am a rooster. We had him in our song and in our first book. What does the rooster say? Wakes up all the farm animals up in the morning. All right, so we're gonna fold that up. We're gonna go on and make another guess. Who am I? I have horns. Hmm. I have horns. You can't see too much of this animal. Do you want to make a guess? Give you another clue. I have a beard. Oh, look at his beard over here. Right over here. Horns. You can't see the horns and a beard. Can you guess? I am a goat. Oh. 
Miss Jenny, that's the director of our library, loves, loves, loves goats. And she has a stuffed goat that she takes around and goes places with her. All right. A goat. How about this one? Who am I? I have spots. Okay. Black spots and a white body. Can you guess? I'll give you another clue. I can move. I bet you know now what animal is that. I am a cow. Good job guessing. All right, we're going to fold the cow back up. How about this one? Who am I? I say, bah. This animal was in our song, too. My coat is woolly. Do you remember what animal that was? I am a sheep. A big woolly sheep. We had him in our song. All right, last one. Who am I? I have hooves. We had this animal um, in the first book. I have hooves. I say, hee ho, hee ho. I am a donkey. Do you remember the donkey in our first story? All right, so there is another donkey. So this is a great book for toddlers, just called Farm Animals. They have another one. Um, city animals and there's a bunch of different ones um, in this series so you can check it out at the library give us a call and 412-885-2255 and we can get any books you want ready you can say make me an animal book bundle and we can get book bundles together for you in any topic that you want and you can pick them up curbside all right so we're going to do, we're going to use these um, instruments again, these musical things. So um, we're going to, we're going to do a little song. Um, Old MacDonald had a band. All right. So you need your two sticks or wooden spoons. You need something that shakes. And what Miss Dolores do with it? Here it is. And then you need your um, dish towel, washcloth, or scarf. All right. You ready? All right. We're going to clap. Ready? Old MacDonald had a band. E-I-E-I-O, and in that band he had a shaker. Can you get something that shakes? E-I-E-I-O, let's shake with a shake, shake here and a shake, shake there. Here a shake, there a shake, everywhere a shake, shake. Old MacDonald had a band. E-I-E-I-O, good job. All right. And in that band, he had two sticks. Can we count them? One, two. E-I-E-I-O, let's tap with a tap, tap here and a tap, tap there. Here a tap, there a tap, everywhere a tap, tap. Old MacDonald had a band. E-I-E-I-O, good job. And in that band, he had a scarf. Can you get your scarf or your washcloth? E-I-E-I-O, let's wave with a wave, wave here and a wave, wave there. Here a wave, there a wave, everywhere a wave, wave. Old MacDonald had a band. E-I-E-I-O. Okay, you can't have a band without making some noise. So we're going to get one of our wooden spoons, one of our shakers, or whatever you're using. We're going to bang them together. Ready? And in that band, they made some noise. E-I-E-I-O. Let's bang with a bang, bang here and a bang, bang there. Here a bang, there a bang, everywhere a bang, bang. Old MacDonald had a band. E-I-E-I-O. Shake that shake. Good job, my friends. We're going to do Hello, Goodbye, Bubble. This is Hello, Bubble. And then we're going to do Goodbye, Bubble. Okay, so I'm going to give you a few minutes to get your bubbles together, and then we'll sing our song together. All right, are you ready for our Hello, Goodbye, Bubble song? Look at all these bubbles. Are you ready? Here we go. Hello, Bubble. Hello, Bubble. Come and land. Come and land right in the middle, right in the middle of my hand, of my hand. Goodbye, Bubble.
Goodbye, Bubble. Time to go. Time to go. I can help you. I can help you with a blow. With a blow. Can you catch your bubbles? And Miss Dolores will catch all of these at the library. And I hope you come back next week to catch another episode of Tiny Tales next Tuesday at 10.30. Um, thanks for tuning in. Hope you have a great week.